It's my favorite time of the year, especially for nail art, so today I'm bringing you another ultimate guide to Christmas nail art. That's right, 10 cute and fun holiday designs. You can choose to do one as an accent nail, mix and match a few, or you could do all 10. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and let me know down in the comments which design is your favorite. Let's start with the Christmas tree. To begin, paint your nail two thin coats of a white polish. Next, use a green striper to paint two vertical lines to form a triangle. Once that's done, use the striper or a toothpick to fill it in. Now that you have the base of the tree, just add some glitter to represent ornaments and add a little gem at the top of the tree. If you don't have a rhinestone, just add a yellow dot instead. And that's it! It wouldn't be Christmas without a candy cane. To paint the sweet treat on your nail, begin by painting the nail white. Next, use a green striper to add a thin diagonal line near the cuticle. Then add two more lines across the nail and fill it in to form a thicker stripe. Once you're done that, add one more thin green line below the thick one. Move on to red and add a thin line. Then finish the design by adding two more and filling it in to form another thick stripe. And there you go! Next up is a pretty holly design. Begin by painting your nail with a metallic gold polish. Then to create the berries in this design, you can either put down some clear polish and add three rhinestones like I'm doing here, or you could simply use a dotting tool and a red polish to create them. To easily make the leaves, use a dark green polish and a toothpick to add six dots like so. Then, connect all of the dots together with the toothpick to form a pointy leaf. Once you're finished that, fill it in. Do the same on the other side and you're done. Now for a pretty snowflake with an ombre background. Begin by painting the nail two thin coats of white. This will make the ombre colors pop. Once the white has completely dried, use a makeup sponge and add some dark and light blue polish onto it. Quickly sponge the colors over your nail. It's best to use a porous makeup sponge when doing this. Then re-add the colors onto the sponge and sponge a second layer to increase the opacity. Once you're done, add a top coat to blend the colors together even more. This will also help prevent you from removing the color during the nail cleanup process. It's important to do a really nice job cleaning up the excess polish around this nail as it will give the final result a more polished and professional look. You can use cotton swabs dipped into nail polish remover to do this, or you could also use a tiny paintbrush. Next, use a white striper to cross three lines to form an asterisk shape. You know, like that little star above the number 8 on your keyboard. If your nail is big enough, add another. Then finish the snowflakes by adding dots at the ends of all the lines. And you're finished! So we obviously need a Santa nail, so let's try his suit. This one's really cute. Begin by painting your nail red. Next, use a white polish and stroke the brush downward to add a thick stripe down the middle of the nail. Next, use a dotting tool and a white polish to gently pull the white polish on the tip of the nail like so. Once you're finished that, add two black lines across the middle of the nail. The easiest way to do this is by keeping the brush still and slowly rotating your finger instead. Fill in the middle with a black striper or toothpick. Then complete his belt by adding a gold buckle using a toothpick. Try using a stippling motion for best results. Ta-da! Now for a pretty little golden bell. Begin by painting your nail white. Then use a toothpick and a yellow polish to draw the shape of a bell. Make sure the white polish is completely dried so you don't scrape up the white polish with the toothpick. Once you're finished the outline, fill it in. Again, I like to use a stippling motion when using toothpicks. Next, use a black striper to outline the bell. Try and do the thinnest outline possible for a cleaner look and have both hands rested on the table. Add a little circle coming out of the bell. Finally, use a red striper to add two curvy lines for the ribbon at the top. And you could always add a little yellow rhinestone for some extra bling. And that's it! Next up is a simple close-up of a Christmas tree with some ornaments hanging on it. Begin by painting your nail green. Then use a silver glitter striper to add some diagonal lines across the nail for garland. 
Use a big dotting tool to add a couple of ornaments. Once they are dry, use a black striper to add little black tops to the ornaments and then little lines for them to hang. Pretty easy! Moving on to a delicious gingerbread man. Begin by painting your nail a light brown. Then use a white striper to add a curvy line near the cuticle. Then use a toothpick or a dotting tool to add two little black eyes. Use a bigger dotting tool to add two red cheeks. And finally, take a black striper and start from one cheek and connect it to the other with a big curved line for his smile. Another cute and easy design for the holidays! Okay, so we only have a couple of designs left. This one is a holiday wreath. Begin by painting your nail white. Then use a light green striper to add little strokes in a big circle. Take your time while you do this and keep both hands rested on the table. Then do the same thing but this time with a dark green. Uh, no. Nope, not happening. As you can see, layering this darker green over it gives the wreath dimension. Then use a red striper and add a big bow on the top of the wreath. Using a striper for this can be a little tricky, so you could always just use a dotting tool and a red polish to make the bow out of dots instead. And that's it! Last but not least is Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Begin by painting your nail white. Then use a brown polish to add half of a circle onto the tip of your nail. Then fill it in. Now press the very tip of the brush onto the nail to add some little pointy ears coming out from his head. Then take a darker brown or black polish and a toothpick to add his antlers. This is really simple, just add a vertical line and have two little ones branching out from it. Finally add some black ovals with a toothpick for eyes and then add a smaller half circle in red for his nose. And of course we want Rudolph's nose to be bright and shiny so add some red glitter polish over it. And that's it! Just give your nails a few minutes to dry and then add a fast drying top coat over all of them. I hope these 10 designs help get you in the holiday spirit this year. If you decide to give any of them a try, please share your recreations with me on Twitter and Instagram using the hashtag CutePolish because I'd love to see them. Take care and I'll see you next time! You're watching the ultimate guide to Christmas nail art. The holidays are my favorite time of year for nail art. So in today's video, I'm going to show you 10